Hello traders. Welcome to the basics of technology consumption in the right way so we can see some market rhythm. The technology we are going to use in this video is called Fibonacci A B C extensions. You can use this on any broker platform. It is not limited to the platform I'm going to demonstrate on because uh, we are dealing with basic tools which every platform should have. So I'm going to add the chart of ES to demonstrate the logic and we will stick with the story of S&P itself. Now this is uh, ES futures chart doesn't matter uh, every market has its own vibration and it will express itself through these um, measurement points. So we have this 60 minute chart just to demonstrate what we can do. So we will build on this and we will release three, four tools and put it together and see how it goes from there. So the first demonstration is Fibonacci ABC on 60 minute chart because this is ES chart which is continuously trading 24 hours. So this is a Sunday market open here and then it trades five days continuously, right? There is a cash settlement which takes for less than an hour, 15 minutes every day and then it reopens again. So there may be some gaps during that time too but 90% of the time it is continuous market. When the market closes Friday at the Eastern close, they extend 15 minutes extra. So they stay 15 minutes extra after the market close and, and they reopen again on Sunday evening. So it's Sunday all the way till Friday. So you can see this is a rotation which is going on nicely. We have ways to predict all the stops and bottoms, but that is little heavy duty science. For now, we want to build the basics and in this first demonstration, as I said, we are going to deal with ABC extension. And we are doing this to demonstrate on daily chart. Doesn't mean it only applies on 60 minutes. You can apply this on 15 minutes, four hours daily. Uh, but if you want to trade, you know, one, two trades a week, I think one hour is good chart to play with. All right. First thing we will do is add insert study and every platform should have this. This is called zigzag percentage and I'll do a retracement of 0.25. Now you can play with this number depending on what you are trading. If you're trading Amazon, you may want to have a different number, but you can play this. Keep the quarter numbers. The key is to keep the quarter numbers. You can do 0 0.125, 0 0.25, double of that 0.5 and in that sequence. You can also do multiple of 3, 6 and 9. Uh, there's a lot of science behind it. Why? But just keep it that way for now and we will change the style so it is visible let's make it let's say line in yellow is fine i guess let's keep it at number two the width all this is doing is mathematically giving me the swings in the market now we will start with this, but you will say, hey, this market came here and then it came here, then six hours, this is hourly chart, right? It came down here and went up here. Why did it not pick this up? It can, if you want to see that, you can also get down to one, two, point one, two, five, point one, two, five. There we go. Now it is showing you much faster vibration. So we can keep it at that as well. 
all that is doing is when market is doing this ABC market is going down you have this ABC because we need three points we need three points we'll use point A point B point C starting from ABC and then we will see how far this ABC structure will extend so we can use this A right and then we can do this B and I'm just showing you this one as you see on the chart and then we can do A B and C this ABC and I want to see how far will this structure impulse take the market that is the end point and we are looking for not one end point we're looking for multiple end points measured from that point right so we will use the tool or you can simply do by hand also take this high take this low take this and apply the mathematical formula and you can put this in excel as well you don't have to do it on the chart but it's easy to see visually and add more things as well as we go along right so that is what we are after we are after this impulse abc structure where it will bounce to and can we use that information effectively to trade that is how the abc is designed that's why it is called extension how do you extend this abc how far will you extend this mathematical structure beginning of any complicated structure butterflies bad patterns godly patterns w patterns m patterns there are over 100 patterns they all start with one basic logic a b c now you may say okay this may be i want to have a bigger one this is a nobody is stopping you right this could be a this could be b and then you can say hey where does this impulse go okay i, I want to start from that point that's fine too right this is where the discretionary trading and and the trading methodology and the tools and how you integrate things one by one you have to twist your mind to allow it to integrate one concept with the other and fuse it together and see the holistic picture when you go and see a movie you don't see focus on one actor right there's a scene where you have five people there you're just looking at the all of them holistically unless the camera is zoomed into one single actor or one single object you are your brain is looking at the big picture it's looking at the big snapshot what's going on it's not looking at this price and this price and this price right to beginning to the end you want to keep a picture of the big picture in your mind a movie is playing and if you get carried away that's a problem then you lose the holistic which if you just focus on the table in the movie and there are actors around talking if you shut everything off you don't listen what they're saying you don't listen how the expressions are going on you just focus on that beautiful wooden table you lost focus right so in this trading business focus is to become defocused see a bigger picture and see the game see the rhythm what game is that are they playing trying to play here so these tools which i'm going to share with you they allow us to see the picture the story unfolding in front of you so right now on this platform on the bottom you see there's a fibonacci you know retracement extensions and all these things so what you should look for is is called fibonacci extension sometimes they will call it fibonacci trend based ex price extension right not time you can extend in time you can also extend in price we are looking from price to price i'm using the price to tell me where this abc pattern is going to potentially give me some end points so i can reverse the market and go long or i can join the trend as it is unfolding right so that will be video two about retracement so right now so now we know what are we up to and as i said there's no when market is coming down here you don't know it's going to become like this you don't know you don't see all this right it's happening right here it's happening right here then you say hey i want to go along because i think market is bullish well do a 
So what you do is you do Fibonacci ABC extension A to the top. You can do to its bottom and do to the top. A B C I. So this is again. I can point it here. That's fine. Doesn't matter. I'm just looking at this level. A level, B level, C level. Price one, price two, price three. Now I have some ideas what is going on. Potentially where they will go. Where I can potentially trade. Why they stopped where they stopped. I can have some story unfolding. Ah, so this actor made a move. Right? They played this dice and then you start saying, oh, that's what's going on. He's cheating on his wife. Oh, he's making his million dollar move. Oh, he's gonna steal something. Oh wow, he's gonna sacrifice his life. He's gonna kill himself for other people's. Oh my God, he's such a good guy. He was just pretending to be bad. You know what I'm saying? We don't know. So it's all story. Think about a story. Now this ABC, this opening scene. This is opening scene which gave us the movie. Different plots. If this happens, hey, this could happen. Oh my God, maybe this has happened. This will happen. This will happen, right? Your mind is now able to deduce something. Potential plot. That's what is showing up here is a plot. Potential plot. All right. So we are going to look at the values of what we have set up. So this is ABC, which is right here. Now the blue one right here is ABC expanded to 161. Yellow one is, you can change the color so we can be on the same page, 261. This is yellow one. Blue is 3333, 4.5, 5.5, and 9. These are the, all the numbers, right? You can change this to red. We can say, and I can save it as default. So anytime I use this tool, these settings will be applied. And you should be able to uh, use these settings just. Uh, Stay with the settings. These two are very important settings. Okay. All right. So from ABC, market came down. This is 1.6, 2.6, 3.33. Market came down here, and it bounced 20 points right here. So instead of just saying, "Hey, I think market is bullish." It's coming down. I'll just buy randomly. Now you are going to buy at a structured level. It's not telling you anything about the trend, nothing. It's just telling you if you are going to go long in this pullback, this is good area to go long. It's telling us that this area is very strong to go long. So this area which I gave you is a secret of market makers levels. 450 to 555 extension. Okay. This has been expanded 450 times and market if you buy options you just let it play and what happened from here to there 66 to 86 20 points here 20 points there 66 to 87 yeah 21 points 20 points right so if you had as many SNP option 10 contracts you made two thousand dollars in a few hours, like uh, one day, half a day, right? So, but you have to play. If you don't have ES trading, you know, it's high risk. I recommend trading ES future options. So you can buy a call, buy a single call ES future option. You will be up 700 to 1400 per contract every 10 points. 20 points will be up $1,500. Future, you will be up $2,000, right? You are always protected. You cannot lose more than what you paid for the call. All right. So now you can see within two days, you're able to make five grand because you knew the structure is folding and you had the long bias and you had the structure where you will trade. Now, if this one breaks, why we got this 999? This is a law of nature. In the universe, there are only nine numbers. The whole universe is built between one to nine numbers. God doesn't use any complicated analytical functions which need, you know, numerical solutions because they cannot solve those complex, confused functions through analytical methods, right? All you need, the whole market is just 
flow of 1 to 9, 1 to 9. Very easy, but very complicated because mind cannot comprehend. Because you have to see the laws of nature in a different ways, not what they teach you. Right? You have to see. I can tell you from this point, market will make this high or low point because this price has the DNA for this whole week. Opening print of Sunday has a DNA of the whole print. If you watch my other videos, which I have not shared, just single impulse, you can see the whole vibration. But you have to apply the laws of nature, not what they teach us, right? So, story is, don't use too much of emotions. Use your sentiment analysis or bias or whatever analytics you are using to take the bias. But once you have the bias, you may be wrong. You don't know it's going to go here. But you made your choice here that you will go long. And you will go long at the critical levels. Right here, right here, and right here. And all of these critical levels worked in your favor. 20 points here, 20 points here, this is 50 points here. This is 60 points here. So you made 100 points, that is $5,000 for single contract. 10 contracts, you made 50 grand if you were able to play this exactly in one week. See that? But your emotions will not let you do it. That's the biggest challenge. So it happened once here, it happens twice here, right? Holding the levels. It went a little forward. Now you can see this is also your head and shoulder, but this is shoulder should be higher, but that's fine. Or you can say, now one pattern you can see here, you can see this one here. Market, take this level, double top, it breaks it on the way, comes back and retest not this, but the prior one. See this one, it's like a head and shoulder right here. This is pattern you will see over and over and over. So at the critical level, you're playing the game, they will break it because they're giving a false impression. Oh my God, they're breaking the level, they're going short. It broke the support, it broke the support, it's going down. What happens? They blow up on your face. That's their game, that's what they do. That's how they steal money from everybody. That's their job. They flush the people, take it to the top side, retest it, the prior level. Watch this pattern over and over. They call it head and shoulder, but I call it fake out, fake breakout and retest of the prior level. Think about it. Think about this. They broke it. Don't worry about head and shoulder, all these complicated names. This level was broken. Stop loss. People who want to go, who are breakout traders, like all you guys are. They will flush you out, giving you the false impression, and they'll catch you on the wrong side, and flush it on you, and bring it down to do this, okay? Now I'll tell you what this level is in the next tool. So this is ABC, okay? Now at this point, you should have taken one more trade, right? So this, in two weeks time you're able to catch the whole map this is what the structures tell you what's really going on now you keep the structure now there are also structure on the other side too right this is short player structure long player structure how about this why it stopped here well let's do abc from here right that's why i'm saying you have to do abc on both sides or you can do it on two charts let's do it on two charts if you want or we can just do it like this get used to it you know so that's why you have to mark these levels so you don't get confused your mind li loves to get confused so these are my levels i will trade at this so i have this and i will make it like green this is my long levels i will make it color green so i have a visual impact what the hell this is this is my long levels going long levels right All right, so at this ABC was, with this ABC market is going down, I made these structures. I said, okay, these are my levels I will trade. And I will patiently wait and not do anything until I reach this 261, 333. I just gave you these levels, right? Market is just vibrating at this level for a reason. Now you see why. So I'll plot all this. When market is just here, I plotted all this roadmap. 
and I have action plan. I will take action here, here, and I will just rest. Nothing else. Right? At the same time, when market reaches the 999 level, you also have responsibility to go on the other side too. So I will do the same thing on the other side. Go to my Fibonacci extension. This is the low. I will take this low. Take this high. A, B, C. I'm using the A, B, C bars, right? I'm using A, B, and C bars. All right. So now I have the other structure. I can remove this one, old one. Okay. So I know I will trade at this levels. Just draw this one. Market is going up like this. You can do it here also. You can do. I will show you very quickly. Okay. Now this I took this A. B and C, this is hourly bar. So I took this, I took this low, took this high. It could be one bar, two bar, three bar, doesn't matter. Zigzag happened here. So I took the high of the zigzag. Zig here, zag here, zig here. What do I get? This is blue is 1.6 extension. This is 2.6 extension. What did market do? Exactly went to this level. So I'll plot these level. Just market is going here. I'll plot them. So I'm building a structure and say, okay, this is my level and this is my level. So I, I just plot them like this and nothing else. So I have a clear picture of what is really going on. All right. So I plotted both sides. I can now take it out. Right now I'm here. I played, played this one, this played this one, this right. And I know these numbers. I can just write down a text also. Put a text here. Take a picture. Print it out. On put it on your desk. You have to do homework. This is real serious business, right? And then market came down here. ABC. We got this ABC. Then also, what is stopping us to do this smaller one too? We can do waves inside waves. ABC inside ABC. Okay. More overlaps we get, better for us. So what happened here? From this ABC, this red line is 999 this is 4 and 5 level 450 550 now you see this this wave 450 550 was here F from this wave 450 550 was here this one see that so i'll just plot it like this as well so okay i use this wave and it's most likely going to go here so now what has happened here i have a double oopsie daisy i'm just making it Maybe a different kind of a green. So I know this is coming from a different one. So right. So I can say, hey, I measured this one, and this was the first greens, and I'm measuring this one. I have different kind of greens right now, right? So there we go. So now we have two waves. One waves 99 line level. One waves 455 level. They all coincided here. This is 450 of this. 450, 550. This is the two lines are. If you double click, you see this. So you remember the colors with time is simple. So now I have two things here for a stronger move and we got a huge move 50 points five dollars ten contracts five thousand dollars with time decay four thousand dollars all right so now this way we got this one successful got this one successful now market is holding 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 and it's hard to come down like this and say hey i want to go long again and you have this level already printed out you do abc here as well on the short side so let's remove this one now you see this is where you are not used to integrating things you practice practice huge practice we'll go from here abc what is it now from this abc this is yellow line here this is the blue line here abc 161 1 261 huge winning 261 here is coinciding with this 900 levels from the top wave from this top wave see this from this top ABC, this is 900. From this smaller wave, this is 250, 260. This is also again from this wave, the level of 450. Now we have three things coming together. And again, market went long. There's nothing random in the market. 45 points, 4.5 dollars in a matter of a few hours. One hour bar, one, two, three, five hours. You're making thousand dollars an hour. But you have to do this. This is like full focus mania. You just have to get part of it. You have to just vibrate with one market. One market, not confusion. I'm looking at this five stocks. I'm looking at this. Oh, I'm looking at this. Oh, I look at this. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. 
<laughs> look at what look at what do the same confusion and apply on this zigzags you'll make a lot more money okay if you are confused and chaotic and you are this is chaos but you are finding the meaning behind chaos you're finding the rhythm behind chaos and now you know it's working wave superimposed upon superimposed upon the other wave so now from this now i can track it now i know this is from the previous wave so i can okay come with some color scheme hey first wave light blue i mean right green if you want to go long this other color and this is from abc i'll make one more color now this is this color right so make it uh, maybe this one so you see that so i know i'm putting it under this wave so i know this one came from this abc i'm putting this under this one i know it came from this abc now i say okay now i can see i'm not confused if i come tomorrow and say okay this big ones have big levels that means they came from the very very top when the market really initiated it's moved down then this one came from abc you can just see that i just put it there this one came from this ABC. I put it there. Now, what is stopping us going forward? Nothing is stopping us. We are not unstoppable. Market came down here, boom, 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 and it started coming down. You, you know this level. You know this level. This is very critical level. First time, second time, you know it's gonna break eventually. So we can test and see if we are able to see this level or not. So do the same thing. We can do it from here, ABC, or we can do it from ABC. Now that is discriminationary, but there's no. Uh, I, I can't tell you which one to use right now. I will show you in the next video, which we can probably use to qualify. So what happened here? Now this wave, ABC, gave us this blue line. Sorry, not this is not the blue line. I, say, I know the colors. Okay, now there we go. So this one ABC gave me, this is, what is this? This is 160. Right, 160. This has been 160. You can take them. Okay, we took some profit and then we got stopped out. That's fine. Now, what do you do? Go to the next level 260 and 300. There we go. Market came down. Now, if you see here, market came down to this level and it moved from here to here. It moved like 15 points right here. One hour bar, single bar moved 15 points. Came down to 333. Was the wave was not over in their mind. Okay, so now we have this level printed out. So we'll print it out again. I said, okay, we will trade this level. And I'm putting it where I got this measurement from under this so I can track it in my mind. So I'll change a different color this time. I said, okay, I'm using this ABC and this is the wave end for that. I can also right click and say clone drawing. And this is my other one. It never reached my 450 level. This is 450-500 level, right? So it never got there and I will move it under my way where I measured from so it got here and it bounced so here is where you can use your RSI stochastic MACD to get some in interesting phenomena but you can see this randomness has measurements and we are just using one tool right now all right so there we are so you may this is the numbers I use you can use different numbers all right, so let's go forward. And so now I used, uh, what did we do here? We used, see this one now, this is, you can get can confused. I know, oh, now immediately I know this red came from somewhere here, ABC, now I can see it, okay, where I am. So I'm gonna go down, ABC, okay, this ABC from this ABC downward move here. Okay, I got that. Okay, now I can track, and I'm playing the story again. It's like rewinding because somebody, uh, rang the doorbell or somebody called and you got distracted from the movie and you lost your focus so now you're going back into focus and so you're rewinding the movie and say okay 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 this is what's going on so you're getting back in the motion getting back in the rhythm so i know this is abc i can see this one predicted this one so i can take it out okay so now i have my structures coming in now market came down and market came up and did this abc again this is the bottom see this was a big bar so let me see this ABC so okay this is my structure so I'll use this ABC I will use the endpoint this zigzag is telling us mathematical correct structure then I use the actual bar high I can use this low and I can use oh sorry I will use ABC price extension all right
We're gonna use this one too. Okay, so it's done. So what do we see here? This ABC has structure of 161 and 261 right here, right? So since I'm using a bigger wave, I'm using bigger ABC, right? I have this point, so I'll draw it here so I know this ABC was used to locate those levels. So if I want to go short, wait for this level or this level or higher up. So in a bigger wave, you can see this is the way market is going to go and take some direction, right? So if you say, okay, now how do we enter this? There are so many techniques, you know, uh, for doing things. I can tell you how to enter this precisely at this point. You would not know that, right? Uh, but understand the basics. You know, you are talking about becoming professional, right? So we will use what we call SERL pullback. So people who have the SERL is a paid course. They know exactly this is the breakout right here at entry and pullback right here. They know this level right here. You don't know that because that's part of the paid program. So that is designed for exactly catching the initial points of every swing. That is what it is designed for. But now this one adds you a structure. Hey, okay. Even if you want to use SERL, use it on here or use it on here, right? You don't know what SERL is because that is basically an entry methodology. How do you enter into the trade? So this is our ABC structure. You can just see very clearly how market is reacting and going to these levels. There's no magic. So we can also do this and say, okay, let's do this ABC on this coming down. He said, oh, this is a double top. It's going to come down. Okay, let's do ABC on the downside. There's no guarantee that it's going to exactly follow what you think. So these are the levels, right? It went to nothing. It went to only 100%. AB equal to CD. That's fine. So now, if you want to ride the trend, this is what I was telling one of uh, my friends. If you want to ride this trend and you know it will go here, don't just ride when it is going here or when it is somewhere, you know, here. Oh my God, it's going to break and so let it pump back. Let it pull back better price so what has happened here a b c let me make one as this so you can understand what it is see that a b c this is 100 percent return on this wave we want it to come down to here or here or here right it doesn't come because trend is strong so it'll at least retrace 100 percent now this is going to be a long entry right a long one pull back if you have a moving average touch technology this will be touch of 30 shoom now you see that you are going in the direction up to this point or up to this point and wait for the pullback 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 you can do abc pullback 100 percent or lower or you can also do one touch technology pullback right all right and you can say, okay, let me use this wave too. Let's use it. So waves inside waves, A, B, C. We start from here, go from there. I'm just doing it live in front of you. There's no guarantee, but this is what it is. Sometimes you want to adjust this. So we don't know initially, we'll just use this. We top, sorry, we use this. ABC. So we said, okay, this ABC, ABC will get the market to this level, 161. So what I'm going to do, where I measured my ABC on top of that, I will put it here. So I know this ABC, this levels came from this ABC, looking for shorts here. This ABC came, gave us this level, which is 161, right? So at least if you want to redo the level and say, okay, hey, what is this level? So you can just re go back here below this ABC and see oh, this is 161, very strong level. So there we go. 29, 20, 29, 30 points. 30 points, right? Boom. 
and you can do smaller waves too who is stopping us no one is stopping stopping us because you are unstoppable so a b c came down to 261 right so we don't know where it will stop because we just have the levels okay smaller levels i will go to smaller levels i will uh go to 260 or higher right so it went to 260 and this came from here so i will just move it here and i'll make it green so there we go now you see this one now i can take it out and then i can say okay let me also plot these levels market might come down here we don't know it still has not visited that right so there we go all right so this is how abc works abc extension works and this is, these are the numbers i use this is how i give you the level, uh, levels one of the levels ways of doing it and uh, professionally use it and there are waves inside waves so there are other ways of doing a lot of things with this uh, but there we go at least you have some basic foundation which you have to use very very important so i will close this video here and we will use the same structure and same things i'll keep it printed and i will move to the second tool called fibonacci retracements thank you